is happening here? So let's say a person has no misalignment, right? The eyes are pointing at the right spot. And this is the image of the cube. It's falling on the central part of the vision in the left eye and the right eye. There's no pathology here. So the eyes are perfectly aligned with one another. Let's say right eye has exotropia. Now the right eye is pointing outward. And, and this is how I can tell from photos and videos if people have a misalignment by literally looking at where their pupils are pointing in their photos and videos. So in this case, the right eye is pointing outward, let's say in 15 degrees or 30 diopters. You see, as the right eye is pointing outward here, that same cube, instead of falling on the central part of the vision, it's falling on another position in the retina. And that is why your brain perceives it to be uh, in a different location when you're switching between your eyes and you notice that image jump from one eye to the other. So how prisms work is that when I prescribe prism, it moves that image. If I prescribe prism to the right eye, see, it moves the image to the right and now it's landing on the central part of the vision. And that's where your brain would be able to perceive that object to be projecting from the same exact position in the right eye and in the left eye.